so we're down at Gizmo. The time has come uh, for Felix and Boogie to go back with foster mums. So Josie's just taken all the stuff out of the cage. So Boogie and Felix now on their own. Um, we're just doing the last few checks. Um, and then we're good to go. So here we go. So that was Uh oh making a quick entrance and pretending she doesn't uh, know anyone because she was looking after little Boogie. But of course she's showing more interest in the food at the moment, which is normal common behaviour of the moms when they first come in. Uh oh, still taking it uh, very, very easy. She hasn't really made any move towards the little ones. I'm not too sure if she knows they're just a little bit too boisterous and it's not a good idea to get involved uh, too soon. Uh, of course, she has to let them know who's in charge and uh, probably doesn't want to have a little bit of mayhem going around, especially with these two. So very, very uh, good tactics on her end, pretending she's finding and looking for things and getting the little ones now interested in her. Um, so they've sort of come over themselves, it's not her that's gone to them, and uh, they're starting to show uh, a little bit more interest in, uh, in her behaviour. So hopefully, hopefully this is going to help things. As I say, these foster moms are very clever, they, they know what they're doing and uh, they know how to handle the little ones, of course, with years of experience. <laughs> so just look at these two little ones from being these boisterous little guys jumping around and going mad. At the moment they're showing interest in what she's doing. Uh, they seem to have calmed down a bit and uh, are more interested um, in trying to get mom uh, really to notice them. It's all right, I got it. <laughs> so that was Poppy, just uh, <laughs> turned up all of a sudden. So we sprung into action. And uh, so there we go, we have both uh, mums in now. Everyone filming. Felix reuniting with Poppy.
Felix waiting for some more milk. <laughs> Taking every opportunity he can get. Scooby was outside one of O's previous foster babies from many years ago. There's Pokey, another one of O's fosters. So whose milk this is is for Becky? This is Boogie and Felix's. Um, yeah, Boogie is still on a controlled diet um, for his milk, so he has a certain amount of milk per day. But him and Felix are having together. Um, so I'm just making them together and then I'll split them into the two bottles and then Boogie hopefully will down all of his and Felix hopefully will down all of his. Um, but we will have to go back for Felix more times than Boogie because he drinks more. <laughs> And they're getting their added protexin probiotics. So they both get 60 mils of milk at lunch and then Boogie gets 45 mils and Felix 60 in the afternoon and they both get 60 in the morning. He's going to take the bottles up, there's Gizmo Troop on the left, all gone in because it's sunny now, Gabriel. And here is who's in first? Boogie? Uh, yeah. Felix? Boogie's in first. Mum uh oh waiting on top. Yummy. Let go. Oh, Helen's come to say hi. With Marcy. He's winning. Uh, looks like Felix actually, which is a first. I feel like Felix has got the better technique. <laughs> Lower than the bottom. So Becky, as animal manager, what have you been up to today? Uh, lots of things. There's Poppy on top. <laughs> um, so I did a lot of monkey checks this morning. Uh, I mean, first thing I did was Zeb's dewormer. So Zebulon is an orphan from last year. Um, he's doing, he's got a three day course of panicure. Um, which is a dewormer, um, so I gave that to him this morning, so he has that in a syringe uh, to make sure he has it, um, and all of it. And then I went and checked on Snow White in H&B, 
she's got a little bit of a lump on her back so we went to go see that we've actually just got a trap so we want to get that looked at more um i checked out pedro who's got a bite on his back um also in hmb um so i looked at that he's should be all right um then i looked at count who is also old so everybody in hmb is kind of old um so I checked on him because he's lost a little bit of weight. Um, then where did I go? Jessie and Engelke, another oldie. Um, she needed to come in for another one of her monthly dewormers. So uh, I trapped her. He's finished. Felix is finished. Felix first. finished. Uh, the whole bottle. Um, so I trapped Jessie, um, tried to give her her dewormer. That was not as easy as it <laughs> is than it should be. Um, so then I raked out her enclosure, sprayed that with some disinfectants and stuff, um, fed her, food monitored her, and then I checked on Queenie with Josie. So we've got a lot of old monkeys at the moment and it's winter so life is a little bit more difficult for them, it's a bit of a struggle. Um, so we're just making sure everybody's okay, there's not as much grass and as much vegetation. Um, and as they get older obviously their teeth start to get worse so we want to make sure that they are okay. Um, so that's pretty much what I did this morning, was made the rounds on all the old monkeys. Um, oh, and I looked at a faecal as well. So I looked at Jessie's faecal. Um, so we were looking for parasites um, of many different kinds, and we found some B. coli, which is usually uh, secondary to something else. Um, but that was cool to see. And that's Balantidium coli, not E. coli, which is the bacteria. So Balantidium coli is a protozoa, and E. coli is a bacteria. Oh, and checked on Eddie Coco as well. So Eddie Coco is in surgery at the moment. He's taken a decline neurologically. Um, so I checked in on him, um, helped feed him a little bit. Um, he needs hand fed. So I was helping him eat some bananas this morning um, and some fluids. So getting him some fluids with a pipette. Um, his brain is not telling him to eat and drink when it should. So we've got to help him. So all in a morning's work. Yeah, and it's not over yet. <laughs> And what have you got on for this afternoon or don't you know yet? Um, I am teaching Global Troop to Jaya, the sick bay staff, as we're deworming them next week. Um, so she's learning those and then a few more monkey checks here and then a little bit more of admin. Um, so yeah, a diverse day, a busy one. Great, sounds like you've got a definitely a variety of a day there. The monkey's always keeping us on our toes. Thank yes, you very much. Yes, definitely. You are done now. Yes, you're finished. Done 60 mil. You finished. Yeah. I'm just checking how his tummy is. He's not happy about that. Hey. Okay, we'll close you up then. And there we go. Meanwhile, uh oh, is busy grooming Poppy, the two mums, Felix. I'm gonna photobomb. Poppy and Felix eating together, their seed pods. More food is on its way. Hello. <laughs> Everybody's coming, waiting. So now the babies have to respect the mums, wait their turn.
Ski boogie there eating a mum. Mark's just giving them some sickle bush seed pods. So far, so good. Big happy family. All very calm. Poppy on the left and that O on the right. Boogie's already gone in the drink for. Well, these two uh, have really shown us what uh, an integration can all be about and how difficult it can actually be at times. And it's not just getting a foster mum, it's actually getting the little one out there into the troop as well, which is just as important. So I hope you enjoyed this episode. Just like to again thank everybody out there for this, their support, for being part of our family, for always contributing, sharing, watching the adverts. Um, just doing what you can to get us promoted and getting other people to watch is just as important. So thank you, thank you for watching and we'll see you again next week. Mm -hmm.